What is up, y'all? This is JT. I just got these router bits in. I'm not sure the brand. Uh, this is all it says on it. This is high quality. And honestly, I'm quite surprised with the quality because they cut really clean. This is a chamfer. Let me get you a flashlight. This is the chamfer. And it does have a slightly too small of a bearing on it, so it leaves a little ledge right here, which looks good. But if you were doing like a countertop, you wouldn't want that because it'd be hard to clean. But it just does such a good job. Sorry about the focusing. This is on my phone. It does a really good job. I mean, it buzzed right through them. Had no issue, like on the Harbor Freight bits. Uh, a lot of times you'll see like this little gnarly stuff right here. I don't know how to focus this camera. Uh, yeah. And then I did try to do a little groove. And obviously I didn't know where to stop on the groove. But I made just like a little drawer front from a qu uh, quarter inch round over beaded. And a little, I believe it's called a rounded box. It's a, no, it's a cove box. Sorry, cove box. And that's what it looks like. But they did a really good job. Um, fairly clean in this, but I was trying to use this fence. I'd never used it before. And I didn't know how far to go in the corners. So I kind of messed that up a little bit. Just need some practice. I was going to try the V-Groove, and uh, compared to my other, I got a rigid bit and then some uh, Harbor Freight bit, these cut way better. And here's all the rest of them. There's a bigger round over, some flush bits, this is a panel bit so you can drill right in and, and do around windows like for OSB. Uh, flush trim, mortising, straight bit, and a 3mm straight bit. A dovetail, this is a 5 sec 30 seconds OG. Another straight bit, another straight bit, and then a cove, and then a cove box. So a little smaller cove box. And then, I, like I said, I've got the uh, 45 chamfer I used. And I don't know why this camera won't focus. I don't know how to control the focus on it. It's a new phone. Sorry about that. And then, like I said, the V groove. I tested a bunch of the bits to fit in the collet, and they all seem to fit perfect. So no issue there so far. I haven't tested all of them, but obviously I'm not even going to use all of them. I'm just gonna mess around and I will film a video demonstrating the bits but for now you can just see what kind of quality this is pine it's a pretty soft wood but keep in mind that the softer the wood the easier it is to knock the grains out and it didn't knock any grains out not even around this knot not in any of the corners and it just it looks flawless for a trim router that's crazy. So, thank you for watching. I will film this uh, so you can see better. And then also keep an eye on these to see how fast they gum up and how easy they are to clean. So, this one's already pretty gummed up. Alright, stay tuned. Thanks for watching.